We have the Brangelina custody agreement papers and waiting to hear the links that Brad Pitt will have to go to to see his children. We're also getting to the bottom of a new report that Angelina plans to move the kids permanently out of the United States. The headlines put a kind of maleficent spin on the whole nasty divorce and custody battle. Angelina's endgame, hoping to move to London with the kids as she aims to land a top job with the United Nations. I joined the UN. They were amazing what they were doing in the field to help people. I understand you're actually open to politics. <laughs> I'm not answering that tonight. Yeah, being a goodwill ambassador is important to Angelina, but we're told the rumors are not true. Angie's rep cleared it up for us saying, quote, she has no intention of moving to London. In fact, she is looking for a new home in the Los Angeles area so that she can continue the family therapy sessions. And today, we're getting a detailed look at the Jolie Pitts' lives now. E.T. obtained the five-page legal custody agreement signed by Brad and Angelina back in October before Brad was cleared by the DCFS and FBI of any wrongdoing. We see that Brad has to submit to random drug and alcohol testing basically once a week. He also has weekly therapy sessions and the entire family must have conjoint sessions together. Kelly Chang Rickard is a family law attorney who has consulted with the same psychiatrist the Jolie Pitts are using now. This particular therapist assigned to their case is neither pro-mom or pro-dad. He's known to be neutral, and he also works very well with kids of all ages. So with Christmas just two and a half weeks away, will Brad see his children over the holiday? A source tells us that's unclear, quote, if a child says they don't want to see Brad for Christmas, the psychiatrist isn't going to force them. My personal opinion is that Angelina grew up in a very rocky family where she did not see her father. And although she might think this is normal, California law does not see sole custody as best interest of the children. She's gonna have to share. The law makes Angie share. 